When published in the second half of the 19th century, Jules Verne's 20,000 Leagues Under the Seas sparked the imaginations of children and adults alike. The Nautilus, detailed in the book, was an extremely large and technologically advanced submarine for its time. This 230-foot-long fictional vessel had a displacement of 1,600 tons. Although Jules Verne based his design on scientific data, many people at the time thought such a vehicle could not be built. They couldn't be more wrong. In this episode of Giant Machines, we'll take a look at deadly giants lurking in the dark waters of the oceans. These massive engineering marvels make Captain Nemo's submarine look like a lifeboat. Let's get to it. Five, the Triumphant class submarine is a class of ballistic missile submarines designed and built by France. It forms the backbone of France's nuclear deterrent the first Triumphant class submarine, Le Triumphant, was launched in 1994, and four submarines have been built in total. This massive submarine class is 453 feet long, with a beam of 41 feet and a draft of 35 feet. It has a displacement of around 15,800 tons when surfaced and around 17,500 tons when submerged. The propulsion system includes a pressurized water K-15 nuclear reactor, two SCMT peel stick diesel alternators, a turbo reduction system, and eight PA-4V200 SM auxiliary motors. The surface speed is 25 knots. Four, the Vanguard class is the largest submarine type ever constructed in the United Kingdom and the third largest type of vessel in Royal Navy service. The Vanguard-class submarine is 492 feet long, with a beam of 42 feet and a draft of 39 feet. It has a displacement of around 19,000 tons when submerged. This massive ship is powered by a Rolls-Royce nuclear pressurized water reactor, which gives it a top speed of around 25 knots when submerged. The submarine can carry up to 16 Trident II D5 submarine-launched ballistic missiles, each armed with multiple nuclear warheads. Three, the Ohio-class is the biggest submarine ever built for the U.S. This class consists of four cruise missile submarines and 14 ballistic missile submarines, which carry almost half of America's active strategic thermonuclear warheads. The Ohio-class submarine is 560 feet long, with a beam of 42 feet and a draft of 36 feet. It has a displacement of around 23,000 tons when submerged operated by a complement of around 155 personnel, including officers, sailors, and engineers. This class can carry up to 24 Trident II D5 submarine-launched ballistic missiles. The submarine is powered by a pressurized water nuclear reactor, which gives it a top speed of around 25 knots when submerged. with a displacement of around 26,500 tons when submerged. The Boré class ranks as the world's second biggest submarine. 
the Beret-class nuclear-powered ballistic missile submarines have a submerged top speed of 25 knots and carry 16 RSM-56 Balava missiles. This submarine class is 560 feet long with a beam of 44 feet and a draft of 33 feet. They were built using 18,740 tons of metal, 68 miles of piping, and 373 miles of wiring. Each of these $713 million Beret-class submarines is powered by an OK-650 nuclear reactor, an AEU steam turbine, a shaft, and a propeller. This class is the first in Russia to run on the pump jet propulsion system. One, the Belgorod class, with a submerged displacement of 48,000 tons. The Typhoon class held the title of the world's largest submarine for more than four decades. Although this submarine class is still considered the most giant submarine ever built, it is no longer commissioned. Well, the Russian Navy had no intention of losing the title it had held for years. Enter the Belgorod class. Although the characteristics of the Belgorod nuclear submarine are a well-kept secret, it is known that she was developed from an uncompleted submarine of anti-class project 949A. The length of the submarine is increased from 505 feet to 603 feet, making the Belgorod the longest submarine in the world. It has a beam of 49 feet. According to some unofficial sources, this massive submarine has a submerged displacement of up to 33,000 tons. The Belgorod class is a mothership for massive Poseidon underwater drones, which are capable of carrying nuclear warheads. Some sources state that in addition to the Poseidon AUVs, this submarine can also operate as the mothership for a single nuclear-powered mini-submarine of the 18511 project, otherwise known as the Paltis type. Well, that's it for this episode. If you have served on one of these amazing submarines or had the opportunity to see one up close, please tell us about it in the comments. We'll see you in the next episode.